another week. Today would be Wednesday. It would be noon. It would be stir fry. All right, what we're going to do today, we're going to talk about some things that have just arrived literally in the last couple of days, and we are feverishly putting them online so that you can purchase them. Um, we now have more Pache airbrushes than right now I'm ready to admit. We have a whole lot, and we have a whole bunch of different ones. And so what I'm going to do for you right now is step through some of the new stuff so that you'll be able to see it. And then I will, of course, encourage you to come down to the store and put one of these in your hot little paws and play with it because, you know, it's what we do. So, without any further ado, we're going to start with the one that requires no air. That's because it really isn't an airbrush. It's a flow pencil, okay? Looks like this. The box looks like this. What you want me to do? Over here? All right, that'll work. Uh, yeah, so it looks this way. Now it still acts like, it acts I guess you could say like a single action, okay, in that you pull back, but the idea is you're writing with it, okay? So you, uh, you're able to do pinstriping and things of that nature with this. So this is the flow pencil. It comes not only with the gun, but it comes with some different tips, it comes with some tools, and this little kit here retails for a whopping 69 bucks. All right, next in line, let's see which one. Okay, we are going to talk about this baby right here. It's called an HG08. And it's a little different. First of all, it doesn't look quite like an airbrush either. It looks more like a spray gun, Ooh, which in itself is kind of exciting. Mondo tool, okay. Mondo tool, not only is it spray gun-like, but it has a pot that is spray gun-like. So you end up with this monstrosity up here. Let's see if I can't get it threaded in. There we go. Looks like so, okay. Now, this one, 95 bucks. But here's the thing. With this guy, there is an extra attachment that you can get that turns it into a splatter gun or a spatter gun. And for you guys doing special effects makeup, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So that's what this one's all about. Mondo, kind of cool. Now, this one's different. It does look like, an, like a spray gun, and it's also going to take hoses different because this is a quarter-inch NPT fitting and not the traditional small fitting that you'd use with an airbrush. So you do need to use a different hose with this. But the good news is, that's a Home Depot hose. That's a Lowe's hose. It's no big deal. Okay. It's also an engineer guy hose, just in case you want to spend money here, which is perfectly okay with me. Okay. Now, next in line, actually, I get to go backwards a little bit. Ooh. There's an $89 one. That's this guy right here. The Juvel. Very nice. Okay. What this is designed for, as you can well imagine, is makeup. Now, in this kit, you'll notice they throw them in the hose. That's kind of cool. But here, this is what makes it different. This is what makes a brush for makeup different than a traditional one. Okay? See this guy? See how small it is? That's the difference. What these folks tend to do is that they tend to make up little tiny batches of the color. They drop the little tiny batch in there. They spray and then when they're through, they clean it out. Once it's clean, then they put the next color in, and they just keep on going. I know some folks will have uh, airbrushes with an interchangeable pot. That's okay, but I think you're gonna find uh, that the, uh, the folks that have been doing this a long, 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 long time are gonna stick to a method like this. So that's what this one's all about. So it's designed for fine work. It's gonna use a very small needle so you get high detail, okay? That's this one. Now, sticking to that, if you can imagine what it, is, what it must be like to be an airbrush artist working on human beings, portability is very, very important. So what our friends at Pache have done is they have made a very special little kit here 
consists of some pretty cool stuff. Not only do you get the airbrush, but you get the hose. You get all these different colors. Okay? They give you some test makeups, so to speak, to where you can practice with this stuff. But then they also give you this. This is a portable compressor. Is that not the bomb? Okay. You charge it up. Boom. It works. So that's what this guy's all about. So this whole kit, this whole enchilada, so to speak, is a whopping 199 bucks. Now, all these prices I'm quoting you are retail prices. That's very, very important to note. Okay. So it comes with all this stuff. And quite frankly, I think the case alone is worth 190 well, okay. It's a really cool case. So, you got all this stuff packed up into one nice, neat little package ready for your use. So, we'll set that here. And I'll set this down here. All right, now, that basically leads us to this guy. This is the uh, I believe it's a new product from them called the TGX-2F, like in Frank, and it's a vision gun. And only in this particular case, ooh la la. Okay, this would be the, the Rolls Royce, I would think. Look at this case. Holy cow. So, first you have to figure out how to unlock it. There we go. Then when you open this guy up and you take this fella out, when you're left-handed, working upside down and backwards is not always easy. There we go. Okay, you'll notice that this guy has a lot more bells and whistles than the average airbrush. Okay, and one of the things that it has that separates it is right here. Okay, you notice there's a little knob right there. That helps control your paint. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, this is the same kind of thing in principle to being able to control your air pressure from back here. I imagine it's going to work a little bit different, but these folks have gone to a great deal of thought to do it a little bit differently over here. And I believe, as I say, that's going to control more the pattern, the output, uh, how dense your paint is going to go down as you spray it. More controls over here. I kind of like the see-through design. Kind of cool. It's like the two-piece bikini of the airbrush world. Kind of neat. Okay, and here, by the way, is a good visual difference. Okay, there's a quarter inch, what we affectionately refer to in the biz as a quarter inch NPT. And uh, by the way, if you can figure out where the quarter inch is on this thing, you let me know. I have no idea. And then you got this. See how the difference is? So this is normal airbrush. This is big industrial size stuff. You can get adapters, you can swap back and forth, but again, it's no big deal to get hoses that look like this, okay? That's off the shelf, just about any old place. These, yeah, you have to go to an airbrush place to get that, so there you go. All right, so that's what we've got going on right now. now so I've talked about all this stuff, and again, I want to encourage you, please come down. You want to try one? No problem. We'll hook it up. You can play with it. You can decide what it is that you like about it. We can certainly answer your questions, but we can answer them live with the airbrush. You can run stuff through it. We're fine with that. But uh, here's the part that I can't completely tell you about because I don't want to ruin the surprise. But let me just say this. We had a very successful sale over the Thanksgiving holiday. And uh, I want to thank you for that, by the way. It was the best sale we've ever had. Well, we can't just bring in a new product like this without launching it with a big bang. So I will tell you that at a date and time to be announced, but it is very soon, within maybe 80 hours, 8-0, it's going to be a big sale on all this stuff. And believe me, you're going to want to pay attention and hopefully you're going to want to go ahead and get the airbrush of your dreams while they're on sale. We also have the single actions. We also have the talon. We also have another version of the talon, which is a siphon feed. So we've got the gravity feed talon, and we've got the siphon feed talon. So we've got 
all these things available. We got a whole bunch of them. We even have a couple of compressors, a bunch of extra hoses, lots of parts. So I think we're set. So that's where we are right now. Uh, it's been a great week. We had a great month in November. We're hoping for a great December. And uh, we hope you'll be part of it. Please stop in. Things are changing every week. And as long as we keep changing things every week, it means we are keep, we're keeping the effort to make things better. So that's the end of that. Nice and short. Have a good one. We'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.